guys, welcome to AS event once again. I've got a lovely bait to show you, which is uh, what we use in uh, summertime. Um, it's generally used for catching brown skates, obviously it's a very popular summertime uh, species that we do get down here. But you can catch grey sharks on it, you can catch brown, um, diamonds, honey cones, stuff like that. It's an all-round bait. Um, using a red eye that attracts all fish species. Again, it's one of those go-to baits when you don't quite know what's uh, out there, what's around, what's feeding. So, very simply, what we have, sharp knife, chocker hammer, a latex cotton, velcro. That's double-sided velcro. Um, demon circle fiver. You can use a tuna circle if you want, but that's a demon circle. Fava, it's manufactured by Mustard, Surflon Supreme, uh, a, it's American fishing wire 7x7, seven seven. Uh, it's soft and supple as you can see, um, it's very nice for those flat calm days and again 21 kilo Maxima Ultra Green as my hook snooting part of it. Very simply take your double sided velcro that you've cut to size and shape and all you do is you put your um, demon circle hook through it. <coughs> And you can see it's, it's very hard to actually pull that loose. Very simple, very easy. Okay. My red eye, I've already cut the head. I'm now going to cut some cutlets to go onto it as well. And <clears throat> generally, it's quite a thick cutlet, my first cutlet that I actually use. I'm just going to cut this little dorsal fin off. Latex cotton. If you don't mind, I'm going to stick between my legs so I can always find it. That'll go on the top side, like that. Very simple, very easy. There's the Velcro. Okay, so there's the first step in the whole uh, process. The second step becomes a lot more difficult just behind the eye. I'm now going to open this up and I'm taking out all the hard parts in the actual head. I'm actually breaking them down. Trocker hammer, it does get a bit messy unfortunately. Just to soften everything up. There we go. So now that is a nice soft juicy piece and that's going on the back part like that and I'm just going to wrap it around just want to get it so it sits properly in the back there we go we just take all these little bits and pieces that are hard that stick out out of the actual bait because you want to try and keep this as soft and supple as possible in the water with as much smell as possible in the water Here we go, next one. This is the tail part of it. And I'm, all I'm trying to do is take the backbone out, so I'm just going to cut this over here. And this bait is quite frozen as well. It works better if you've got one that's a little bit softer than what I've got here. There we go. And again, all I'm going to do is lightly soften it up. Okay, fantastic. Again, all I'm going to do is take it and wrap it around. There we go. And there we go guys, there's your velcro inside, creating the base that your bait's actually going to hold on to. And as you can see, there's a phenomenal little bait that you can throw far, it's going to lie on the bottom, it's going to expose a lot of smell, a lot of flavour to the water very very quickly, and it's going to attract the fish to your bait as fast as can be. There we go, very simple bait for a brown skate, it's not too big, um, sandies will eat it, honeycombs will eat it. Um, of course, grey sharks, if they do come along, you've got the wire for it. Um, and you can see how nice it actually lays on the ground. 
a lot of blood, a lot of smell. It's a go-to bait for your summertime fishing. Here we go.